Assalamu alaikum viewers. Today we are gonna learn about parts of a division with examples. First, do you know what is a division? Division means the act of separating some things. Now let's look at the parts of a division. There are four parts in a division. Number one, dividend. Number two, divisor. Number three, quotient. Number four, remainder. These are the very important parts in a division that you have to know while doing a division. And now we're going to learn these divisions with an example. Now let's look at the division. 45 divided by 9 is equal to blanks. And here we're going to identify the parts. 45 we are dividing 45 the number we are going to divide is the dividend and the number we are going to divide the dividend by is the divisor In this case, we are dividing 45 by 9. Now let's do the walking so that we can get the other two parts of a division, quotient and remainder. Let's start. It was 45 divided by 9. In every division, you have to know the times table from 1 to 15 or else you can't do the division. So here we are dividing 45 by 9. And as I mentioned earlier, the number we are dividing is the dividend. And the number we are going to and the number we are dividing the dividend by is the divisor. Now let's do the division. Nine was a nine. Nine to the eighty. Nine three is a twenty-seven. Nine four is a thirty-six. Nine five is a forty-five. So we have to check how many times will it take for nine to become 45 or almost close to it. But we already got 45 in the nine times table. Nine fives are 45. So let's write it. Nine fives are 45. And now we have to do the subtraction. 45 minus 45 leaves no remainder. It is a zero. The remainder is zero. Now here we got our answer, 5. Now what is 5? The fi 5 is the answer in this division and we call it as quotient. And we got our remaining number as 0. We call the remaining number as remainder. And now what are we gonna write here? We will write 5 only. Here there's a remainder of 0. If there was a, a remainder greater than 0, we could write it here by giving a comma, r, colon and then the remainder which is greater than zero. So I hope you learn the parts of a division with example. And until next time, it's me, Shaf Islam. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like the videos and share them. Bye.